Now let's prepare the toe of the legs. These are rubbers to increase the friction between the wooden foot and the ground. In case that you break one of these, I will supply you five pieces of the rubber. Hopefully, you can have at least four working. It's easy. Pay attention to the direction I'm holding this piece. Be patient and careful. Don't cut this rubber. Don't break it. And after both the loops get to this part, adjust this rubber a little bit to release the uneven tension. So we get one toe. Just do the same thing for the rest of these legs. Take a look at Nibble's tail. You will need the tail piece, the wheel, one screw, and one rivet. First, decide your top face. Choose the better polished side. The same for the wheel. Choose the better face. And then insert the rivet through this hole. You could add some lubricant to reduce friction here. Stack the wheel on top of it. And insert the screw then screw into the center of the wheel now you have this spinning wheel it seems to be just a funny decoration but it's actually quite important in Nibble's motion for this end we will do it after we calibrate the servo.